we're going to talk about what I learned from my experience with a weird color of poop. Bizarre topic, yes, but you know you're going to stick around. Hi, my name is Jody. Welcome to my weight loss vlog, Man vs. Diet, and to my bathroom. That's right. I'm sitting on the toilet right now. Don't worry, the lid is closed, the seat is down. Yes, I'm that kind of man. Well, at least right now. My wife would dispute otherwise. <laughs> this is my fifth weight loss vlog, and over the course of the last four weeks, one thing has disturbed me more than anything else. It wasn't how much weight I've lost or haven't lost. It wasn't how my body was sore after I exercised. It wasn't anything like that. It was, now, you saw the title of this vlog, and you clicked on it, so here you go, TMI alert. It was the color of my poop. <laughs> so, like most human beings in the year 2015, I was freaked out about something, so I went directly to the internet. I, in fact, I went to a message board on MyFitnessPal.com, and I started a thread. And it was pretty funny. And it actually had some good information in it, and I thought, you know, this would make a pretty fun vlog. Okay, I decided to change venues. It was a little awkward sitting on the toilet. Back to this uh, message board. So I started this thread with this post. Started a new regimen about two weeks ago. I'm back on the bandwagon. Sweet. Week one included lots of fruits, veggies, chicken, sweet potatoes, Yukon gold with no dairy, red meat, or sugar slash artificial sweeteners. Week two is a balance of fruits, veggies, eggs, chicken, fish, turkey, bacon, whole wheat products, and cottage cheese. I somehow managed to switch drinking from about 150 ounces of Diet Coke a day, I miss you old friend, to gulping a ton of water and a steady of sweetened soda or two a day. I've also been taking probiotics for the first time ever. And now my poop is kind of a funky, tannish, slightly green color instead of the usual brown. Sorry, but you clicked on the link. Has this happened to anyone else? Is this weird? Will I ever see my brown poop again? I looked at the poop color chart and now I'm freaking out that I have pancreatic cancer or gallbladder issues and I already had my gallbladder removed. Poop experts help me! I don't know if I got any poop experts, but I got a lot of crap from a lot of people for writing this. I got some pretty funny responses here, let's read some. Of Monsters replied, in my professional opinion it is more than likely cancer. Thanks for nothing of Monsters. Rossinator 63 could be the coloring in the soda. I had thought that too, actually, because I drank so much Diet Coke. I thought, heck, there was probably enough artificial caramel color in there to color the Diet Coke and enough poop for a whole neighborhood. That's how much Diet Coke I drank. White and nerdy. It's probably not cancer. It could be changes in the colors of the food you're eating. Lots of kale, spinach will turn your poop green. Or changes in your iron intake. Excess iron leaves the body as a salt, which is green. I would give it another week. If you're not eating a lot of green foods and it doesn't go back to normal, then I would see a physician just to make sure it's nothing more serious. I did talk to a physician. We'll get to that later. I didn't wait a week. I don't know. Maybe I hadn't taken enough of my anxiety pill that day, but I was kind of freaked out. Holly894, snaffling, laughing so hard you snort, then laugh because you snorted, then snort because you laughed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was bad. A typical Smith wrote, Just checked your food diary. You're lucky to have any poop at all, no matter what color. You're eating entirely too few calories. Stop trying to lose all of your weight all at once. It doesn't work. Well, A typical Smith, thank you for that great advice. I was trying to lose almost 200 pounds overnight. If I would have only thought of that beforehand, I wouldn't have tried to lose it all at once. I probably was eating a little bit too few calories, but I mean, it was still like 1,800 calories, so it wasn't that drastic. Jay Polly, try eating a bunch of beets. Freak you out the next day. Yes, it would. And I probably won't try to eat a lot of beets because they're gross. Actually, they're okay if they're cut up in a salad and pickled. Other than that, no thanks. Day 55412, I'm no poop expert, but I'd say that it's just your digestive system getting rid of the stuff that it had in it before you started eating healthy. You could drop a deuce in a Ziploc bag, take it to the doctor, hand it to the receptionist, and say that you want it tested. <laughs> I didn't do that. I might have put a little bit in a plastic bag to show my wife the color. Might have. I won't admit to that. I was freaked out! 
I was reading online and on the color chart, and my color wasn't on there. And it had been like for two weeks. So I, I was getting kind of worried. And uh, the closest color to mine was saying that it could be like these problems with your liver or your pancreas or... I'm not a hypochondriac. My poop can vary in color depending on what I eat. I love that these people are all sharing their poop color with me. I usually eat a lot of vegetables, so it's not unusual for mine to have a bit of green to it. Last week, I ate a ton of spicy Cheetos and ended up with orange. <laughs> uh, oh, what did I start here? Oh, so we have uh, red poop, we have green poop, we have orange poop now, and there's more. And tan poop. Chloe's dad, 0124, gave probably the most poop expert-like answer to me. The stool passes through the intestine too quickly. There might not be enough time for bile to be digested and broken down to provide the normal brownish stool color. Bile is a greenish-brown fluid that is manufactured in the liver and stored in the gallbladder. Bile helps digest fats in food. It takes time for the bile to degrade and turn brown in the intestine, and if the transit time is short, the stool remains green-colored. This is why diarrhea is often greenish in color. Now you know. Iron supplements also may be a cause, though it often turns stool black. Speaking of stool that's black, you ever taken Pepto-Bismol and noticed your poop the next day? And what about those babies when they're newborns? That stuff is gross. Flissy 5. I like a TMI thread, especially when they're about poop. You're welcome. Glad to be of service. Glad my pain and misery and agony and worries are a source of entertainment for you. Flissy 5. Original poster. Have you never changed a diaper? Spinach equals green poop, usually very squishy poop. Yes, I have changed a diaper. <laughs> I've changed lots of diapers. In fact, I've changed lots of poopy diapers. This poop wasn't in a diaper. When you start worrying about stuff, you don't think about diapers. In fact, my wife is telling me that she changes that color of poop every day with my son. And uh, apparently I have too, I just forgot. So forgive me! Here comes Atypical Smith back at me again. She's she's after me. Original poster is hardly eating enough calories to keep a cat alive. Amy Race <laughs> responds, does the cat have green poop too? Bon Jody, which is me, that's a nickname I've been given in recent years. When I said the poop was tannish and slightly green, it's mostly tannish. Maybe I'll poop in a baggie and take it to Home Depot's paint department to get an accurate color sampling. He's a seven freak. I vote for Giardia Lamblia. Better get that checked. Considering my eating habits, I think I'd be more likely to have Giardelli than Giardia Lamblia. I don't know how to pronounce Giardelli, 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 but that is some good chocolate. I love going to San Francisco to the Giardelli factory. The Sundays with that Giardelli fudge. Oh my gosh. P.S. Bon Jody says, I just pooped and I'd say the color is a peanut caramel color. Myri Gal 76 responded, but, but. Did you weigh after? One pound closer to go away. I didn't weigh after. I should have. Duh. Why didn't I? Boston Wolf wrote, if you were consuming stevia in equal measure to your previous Diet Coke fix, I can't imagine how bad your gas must be. That stuff kills me. Oh, uh, my gas is not <laughs> bad right now. Oh, man. My family can thank me for not consuming as much stevia as I did Diet Coke. Hey, at least it's not bright green like my granddaughter's was when she ate the blue-flavored applesauce. Oh, man. That reminds me. I served an LDS mission in France many moons ago. And at the beginning, a couple of the missionaries, <sighs> they gave me some blue Kool-Aid. I was in France. I didn't know. I, I just thought that maybe the French drank different colors of Kool-Aid. It tasted a lot. It tasted a little soapy, but... I thought that was just how French people drink, so I guzzled it down, and that night I kind of freaked out because, yes, my pee was uh, an odd, kind of a greenish-blue color. Oh, boy. Rex Rayner, you obviously have the Ebola, to which I responded, I just pooped it out. Fairy 2B, <laughs> I heart this thread so hard. One of the first times I pooped green, I was bewildered and excitedly exclaimed to my BF, I took the biggest Hulk poo ever. He didn't find it as amusing. I'm so glad I found you all. I find that amusing. <laughs> Congratulations on your Hulk poo. Mine wasn't a Hulk poo. It wasn't green! Oh, and if you ever had a large slushy drink, especially the blue, no joke, it turned the water in the toilet blue. Amazing. Those food dyes are no joke.
No, they aren't. They found out in France. Racing is life, 97, wrote, I used to drink full throttle energy drink. Poop was as green as the preview and post-reply buttons at the bottom of the page. LA Woman 72 my kids would absolutely love this thread. I hope there's one on farting next. <laughs> no, because I don't have gas. <laughs> we already went over this. I hope you get your green poop figured out. Ah. Uh. I didn't have the Hulk poo. Mine gets green when I eat Fruit Loops or drink orange juice. What? <laughs> Why would your poo get green when you eat Fruit Loops and drink orange juice? That makes no sense at all. If I drink one liter of Mountain Dew, it turns almost whitish. So we like had every color of poop in the rainbow here. So it probably was pretty pathetic that I went to... Uh, a message board to try to solve my poop problem. Here's how freaked out I was. My doctor has a new system now that I can send him questions online. I was too embarrassed to fill out the subject line, so I just wrote, my question is about question. I was telling you about the new sugar detox diet that I'd started. I've now been reintroduced to some dairy, grains, etc. Here's the weird thing. It seems like in the past couple of weeks, my stool color has changed to a lighter, almost tan light color. Is that because of the probiotics or meds you have me on? Or maybe the change in diet or something worse? I've been reading online and it's kind of got me freaked out that something is wrong with my liver or pancreas or something else. I don't have a gallbladder. Suggestions? He responded, Generally speaking, stool color means nothing of significance and can fluctuate with diet and medications. Your blood work looked fine. If this was from your gallbladder or pancreas, you would be having significant abdominal pain and or vomiting. I would recommend you stop monitoring the color. Uh, that made me laugh. So I got a doctor's order. So I've stopped monitoring <laughs> the color of uh, what goes in the bowl. Sorry if that was a strange diet topic, but I don't know, it's just weird. You know, you're used to a normal color and then all of a sudden it's different, like drastically different. It just kind of freaked me out. Especially because my color wasn't on Dr. Oz's chart. Thanks a lot, Dr. Oz. This weight loss vlog isn't just about poop this week. I also have a little bit of an update, some exciting news, other than the fact that I don't have pancreatic cancer. Give me a drum roll. I stepped on the scale this week and it went in a positive direction. I felt like I was on a little bit of a plateau. I stayed at about the same weight for about, you know, five or six days. I weigh myself every day, so I know what's going on with my weight. It fluctuates, obviously, but it just wasn't going down. And finally, Brandon the Food Dude guaranteed that if I started exercising, I'd lose more weight. I did that. I started exercising and my weight instantly dropped. And so. Uh, I'm now down 20 pounds from 351.4 to 331.4. So that's pretty exciting. I just feel terrific. My uh, energy is certainly up. This is four weeks off a of Diet Coke for me now. Today I actually kind of craved it. It was interesting. Or at least like a sweet bubbly drink. And I ended up not getting one. I had a protein shake this afternoon that kind of hit the spot but I've just been guzzling the water. Eating really healthy, I've been trying to be creative, using all sorts of different vegetables and the food that I make. Overall, I'm exercising more. I, I went through kind of an, another lull where I just was hard, having a hard time getting myself out to the gym and, and moving, but we went on that family walk on Sunday night. That was kind of a big moment for me because, I mean, it was a mile round trip. We took our time and stopped and talked to neighbors. And, I mean, I was out of breath by the time I got home, but I mean, I was making excuses all the time to get out of family walks. And that's lame, you know? It's, it's fun to go out with the kids and spend time with the wife and be with the family and doing the exercise and enjoyable exercise, especially on a, a nice, beautiful spring night. So I really thoroughly enjoyed being out there. Uh, I hope you guys saw that video and enjoyed that. Uh, my family's kind of nuts. And that's kind of the exciting thing about being on the path that I am now. Before, I would look for excuses to get out of things like that, and now I agreed to go on the walk as soon as my wife said it. I looked forward to it, and I hope to be more and more active in the future, doing more stuff. I mean, I'd love to go play tennis with my son and daughter. They loved it when I played with them a couple years ago. I've been lifting weights. I'm sure you noticed. All in all, things are continuing to head in a good direction. Oh, I also got a special delivery today. A new Fitbit Charge HR. So I think we'll explore with that on the next vlog. Until the next time, rest assured I will not be monitoring the color of my poop. 
Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.